for our final and last lesson in DLE Front Office Services, I want you to watch this short clip. DLE Front Office Services Week 8 is all about interpret design and layout. For our objectives, at the end of the lesson, you are expected to describe parts and functions of a front office reception layout and evaluate a sample front office reception layout. For your learning task 1, fill in the blank circle with answers on the other word related to layout. Write your answers on your intermediate pad paper. I'll give you a minute to think of your layout. Okay, time stop. Let's try to answer. Based on the clip that I showed you, una ang bell desk. From the bell, uh, valley parking, papasok sa entrance. That is the bell desk. Next, we have the front desk. Where the front officers are located. Then the lunch, and for this is your lobby. Do you have the same layout as my layout? If yes, I want to see your layout. Kindly submit it into your Google Classroom in a glass uh, classwork. What is traditional lobby? A lobby is a room in a building used for entry from the outside, sometimes referred to as a foyer, reception, or an entrance hall. It often is a large, vast room or complex of rooms in a theater, opera, concert hall, showroom, cinema, and others adjacent to the auditorium. It is a repose area for spectators and place for venues specifically or especially used before performance or during intermissions, but also as a place of celebrations and festivities after performance. A lobby must have an eye appeal because all visitors enter a hotel from this area. So, lahat ng visitor dumadaan sa lobby. Power lobby. Many office buildings, hotels, and skyscrapers go to a great length to decorate their lobbies to create the right impression and convey an image. This is known as a power lobby. Since the mid-1980s, there was 
there has been a growing trend to think of lobbies as more than just ways to get from the door to the elevator. But instead of social spaces and places of commerce, some research has even been done to develop skills to measure lobby atmosphere so as to improve hotel lobby design. Lobby layout. The layout of the hotel lobby design is one of the most important aspects of its interior design. The layout is basically a blueprint of all the physical elements of design and where they will be put in the lobby. This depends on the circulation space and the estimated number of people that will be using the lobby at any given time. The reception, the main feature of any hotel lobby design is the reception. Always need to be an impressive design formation. The main component of a reception is the desk and its back wall. Both of these need to be designed in an attractive fashion. The black, the back wall may even be embossed with the name of the hotel. The waiting area. All hotel lobby designs have a waiting area. These are not overly large or all encompassing, just a small part of the overall interior. Sometimes designed as an alcove, other times designed along the sidelines. The furniture of the hotel waiting always follow the general color and the lighting scheme of the lobby as a whole. The waiting can also be followed up counterpart of the reception desk with both on opposite ends of the hotel lobby with ample amount of circulation space in between. The final image of a hotel lobby design needs to be holistic. The overall design needs to look cohesive. So even when you design each part, the layout, reception, and the waiting as individual elements of the lobby, there always need to be some visual anchor connecting theme or idea between all of them. Of course, the visual dynamic also has to protect a charisma that attracts the guest and leaves a good first impression. So careful of contrasting of all design elements, color, materials, and lighting is a must. Hotel lobby layout design, you have to consider the proper space utilization for working effectively. Improve efficiency and control of the staff if they have uh, proper spaces. Next, you must also include your desk, front desk should be prominently located overlooking at the counter so kita mo lahat yung sa counter sa lobby next aesthetically appealing and comfortable for the visitors syempre lahat ng visitors ang unang papasukan ay ang lobby makikita doon how impressive that can be categorized your hotel if uh, it's five star or one star. Always depends on the atmosphere of the hotel. Next, aesthetically appealing and comfortable for the visitors. You have to consider that. Best bell desk should be near the entrance to keep an eye on all visitors and in order to offer quick assistance and also for security reasons. So, si Beldes ay laging nasa harap ng 
pinto entrance door. Next, we have the lounge to act as peaceful waiting area. All guest contact sec sections of front office should be strategically located in the lobby. Principles of facility planning. We have eight to consider. Should have served in achieving the long-term goals of the organization. Should be really needed. Should be financially feasible. Should fulfill the needs of the intended user. Should be harmony in harmony with local community and law of the land. Next should be sustainable in long run. Next, we have easy and cheap to maintain. And lastly, suitable for expansion plans in future. For your learning task 3, write T if the statement is correct and F if the statement is wrong. Write the answers in your pad paper and then screenshot it and send it to your Google Classroom. The waiting can also be followed up follow-up counterpart of the reception desk. The main component of reception is the desk and its back wall. The layout of the hotel lobby design is one of the most important uh, aspect of its interior design. And decorating the hotel lobbies is creating the right impression and convey an image known as the power body. And then hotel room in a building is used for entry from the outside. Okay, let's try to answer. We have number one through the waiting can also be followed counterpart of the reception desk. Next, through paren, the main component of reception is the desk and its back wall. Usually, naka-embose ang pangalan ng hotel sa back wall. Next, number three, the layout of the hotel lobby design is one of the most important aspects of interior design. Correct. I agree. Next, number four is through decorating hotel lobbies is creating the right impression and convey an image known as the power lab. True. And then, num last number, a tall... Uh, a hotel room in a building is used for entry from the outside. Actually, this is false. Okay, it's not a hotel room, but rather a lobby. For your assignment, go to your Google Classroom Classwork Week 8 Assignment. If you have no other questions, if you have any questions, you just type to the comment section of your FB page group. FB page group ha, para lahat makakita ng kanilang gagawin. Have a nice day and God bless us all.